Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to unlock Samsung Galaxy A36 without the password. Alright, so let's begin, but also in the beginning I will tell you that please only try to unlock your phone, because trying to unlock someone else's phone can be considered as a crime, and also that's non-ethical, so have that in mind. And let's go straight into the first option. So. The first option is by using Google Find My Device, so first open your browser, simply type Find My Device, get into the first option and now click on Sign In. As you can see currently I'm logged in, but you will need to simply log into your Google account and we have our phone right in here. But for now let's say that this phone is not it's not unlocked, so I'm just giving you an example. So simply click on your Galaxy A36 and now on the bottom you have factory reset device. So simply click on it, now click on next. And in here you just simply need to type your password and you can remotely factory reset your phone. But also please remember that doing this will cause this that all of your data will be erased from the phone permanently so it's good to have a backup if you don't know how to create a one we also have a video on our channel how to perform this so if you want you can find it and that's basically the first option okay second option is by using the recovery mode so now we need to turn off our phone Okay, let's click on power off. And now you will need to have a USB-C cable and also a laptop or a PC. So basically now you need to plug your USB-C cable into your phone and the other and also to your computer. You need to connect both of these devices to each other. Okay, now we have the the information that the phone is currently using, so it's taking battery from the laptop. And that means that both of the devices are connected to each other right now. And now we need to enter the recovery mode and we perform this by simply holding the volume up button and the power button at the same time. So that's what I'm gonna do now. Okay, when the Samsung logo appears, we can release our fingers. And now we are in the recovery mode. To move around this menu, we use the volume buttons. And if you want to confirm the selected option, you just simply need to click the power button. So when I click volume down, I go down, volume up, I go up. That's pretty simple. Okay, so now we want to select wipe data slash factory reset but also please remember that also this option too will cause this that all of your data will be deleted from the phone so now you need to select wipe data confirm by clicking the power power button now again factory data reset again power button and as you can see on the bottom of the screen date wipe complete data wipe complete and now you need to simply select reboot system now, click on power button and now you'll need to set up your phone as a brand new. Now the phone will be automatically turned on in a few seconds, but also if you want and you have this possibility, you can go into the authorized center with the proof of purchase and there look for help. Okay, so that's all in this video. If you find this video helpful, please leave a like, comment and subscribe.